When finding ways to make your home energy efficient, you should start from the bottom up. So where yep. should we look when we're in the basement? Um, in the basement, uh, some of the, uh, the more common areas where we see heat loss is actually where the floor joists meet the top of your foundation wall. But sometimes just by r running your hand up here, you can feel cold air actually blowing into the home. If you feel air leaks, the best solution is to add some closed cell insulation. That's the spray foam kind. It's something you can take care of yourself. I believe the name for it is a froth pack, uh, and you might be able to pick that up at Menards or Home Depot. What I would think about when I'm um, thinking about energy savings and keeping the heat in would be the doors. Yes. Is that a spot that you can... That is a major spot, yep. Uh, doors and windows. And just like in the basement, it's as simple as running your hand across possible problem spots. You know, if you feel right here, if you put your hand right there, you can actually feel... Oh man, look at the draft. You got some cold air coming in. So um. That's not good. What should we do? Replacing the weather stripping can help stop those leaks. Older doors themselves may be the problem if they aren't steel insulated. In that case, Aaron said your best bet may be getting a whole new door. You would probably see it uh, pay for itself right away. You know, on the second story of the home, again, uh, I know we addressed the doors. Uh, windows are also a concern. Okay. This concerns yeah. me. Is, should I be worried about the fact that there's moisture on my windows? What causes the condensation is the warm air in the home and the cold air outside of the home meeting. If that moisture starts to freeze, Aaron says you may have a problem with the window's seal. If not, just try to keep the warm air in your home circulating by consistently running your furnace or ceiling fan. Keep the heat in, keep the cold air out. And don't forget the very top of your home, the attic. Take a tape See measure, the measure the depth of your insulation. If you have uh, 12 inches of, of insulation or better, you're in good shape. If you're a little less than that, and you have the kind of insulation that rolls out, you can just pick up some more yourself. All right, and that was Aaron Martinek of A-Team Construction. And one area he said that homeowners are most surprised to find they're losing heat is in their outlets. If you can feel cool air coming in, you'll want to use that spray foam again and spray just where the wires are coming in. You won't fill the whole electrical box with the insulation. Hmm. Now, if you want a professional to check out your home, you can always find more information from Aaron at MyDreamAteam.com. So overall, how was your house? My house is pretty good. It's 12 years old, so okay. um, I, the codes are pretty good. It, it, it was built pretty mm -hmm. well, but the, he still found leaks around the sure. door mm -hmm. Yeah, um, where simple weather stripping can mm -hmm. really save a lot. Mm -hmm. All right, so just get out there and feel your way around the house. Yes. Yeah, look where anywhere there's, there's mm -hmm. a, you know, a hole, a window, a door, right. anything sure. like that. Okay, you can save good money. Tips. Thanks, Hads. Thanks, You're Hads. welcome. Yeah. We'll be right back.